high adjustment of status I-485 package delivered to USCIS on February 8th, um, I-94 admit till date March 6th, can I stay in the US after March 6th? So here, they came to the United States uh, on a tourist visa, they filed for a green card and their tourist visa is gonna end. And they're asking, can I stay in the United States after my tourist visa ends, even though, you know, since I filed an adjustment of status, I-485 application? The answer is yes, when you do file for a green card application form I-485 and it's done properly, you are in a period of authorized stay, which means I'll let you stay here to get a decision. Now, it doesn't mean you have status, so make that uh, known um, in these kind of cases. If there's an issue or if they want to, the government can come and either, if you're on a B2 tourist visa, put you in immigration court to remove you or deport you from the United States. They have the power to do that, though they typically don't because they know you're going to have an interview eventually or they're going to deal with you. And once that decision is made, if approved, it's approved. If it's denied, it's denied. And they'll send you back home. They let you alone. Now, the times where it comes problem I see is when people have things like a DUI. They get pulled over for driving under the influence or other cr criminal issues that the government says, you know, you do have a green card case pending, but you're doing this wild behavior. What we're going to do is send you to immigration court to remove you from the United States. So by general, uh, I do these kind of cases all the time where people are here. They just change their mind, decide to stay here and to apply for the green card. In those kind of cases, uh, once you file for adjustment of status, it's okay to stay here. Just don't do anything wild, uh, as long as the case is properly submitted within the time. So that's something uh, that's really important. No, we get that question a lot. I hope you enjoyed this educational video. Also, you'll find our social media site has a lot more videos, images, and information about the US immigration process. Please check those out on the various social media websites.